y'all. So I read this story about Four Locos being banned, and you know, I've personally had some battles with Four Locos. I drank two of them bitches and tried fighting one of my best friends one weekend. So there was a 19 year old college student who drank one Four Loco and went to the emergency room complaining that he was having a heart attack. So I don't know about you guys, but the first thing that came to my mind was, this guy's a fucking lightweight. I beer bombed two of them bitches and I was still standing and he's complaining he's having a heart attack. Four Loco challenge. Y'all don't know me. Please. It's people like that that ruin the fun for everybody else. I mean, there's people like me who are very experienced. You know, we don't drink that much. We go to church. We knit sweaters with Sarah Palin. We're just all around children of Jesus. And anyway, I heard that they're being banned because of this. I'm not sure if it's because of whatever happened with this guy or just in general with all the people blacking out. But I just gotta say that I'm gonna stand up for Four Locos right here. And if people ban this video like they ban Four Locos, I'm suing a bitch. Because this is freedom of speech. I Wikipedia that shit. This is just my political opinion. One thing I learned from Sour Palin. Yeah, but anyway, there are these drinks that come in a bunch of different flavors. They basically taste like, like when you know you first hook up with a Mexican guy outside Taco Bell and you're really not sure if he's sweet or sour, but he meets you halfway in the middle. Yeah, they got that kick. Well, to say that Four Loco is a good alcoholic beverage is like saying genital herpes is a good outcome from having sex, which you know is a good outcome if you're into genital herpes. I don't know about y'all, but I ain't trying to get all that. Y'all can have that shit back. That's one gift. I don't want this Kwanzaa. By the way, I just want to put this out there that I do not condone underage drinking at all. I spend my weekends volunteering at Shady Pines and knitting sweaters with Sarah Palin. And remember guys, being a virgin is a beautiful and sacred thing to hold on to. Unless it gets in the way of you having sex. Some of us gotta make money. Don't hate. Don't hate me because I'm beautiful. Hate me because I fucked your boyfriend and all his friends. I get around. It's not like I ever drank four locos, woke up in an alleyway with no underwear, didn't know who entered there, who exited there, how the fuck I got there, how it got in my hair, you know? I still can't get that shit out. See? Shit. I just want to clear this up, by the way. The paparazzi supposedly snapped a picture of me holding a four loco, and I just want to say, that was not mine. I was holding that for my little sister. She was pre-gaming before a keg. Duh. Hmm. What the? Oh, hell no. What's that doing there? <laughs> um, I have no idea how that got there. I swear to God, y'all. My sister must have been in here pre-gaming again. No, but in all honesty, apparently these drinks are considered liquid heroin. And I just want to say that it's great to know that this is finally coming out after I've probably drank a hundred of these bitches. I'm probably going to need rehab after this. Mom, what rehab is Lindsay Lohan at? Book me in that shit. Bitches are crazy. Bitches need a fall, Ooh. they need to understand uh -huh. That Johnny boy is here, and I'm gonna take your man uh -huh. If you think I'm joking, I'll help you understand I'll knock your ass the fuck out, have fun and never land Land, land, <laughs> land, 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 <laughs> land, 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 <laughs> land, land. <laughs> Have fun and never land <laughs> and, and I'm gonna take your man And remember guys being a virgin is a beautiful and sacred thing to hold on to. Unless it gets in the way of you having sex. 